Somebody stop that guy! He just robbed me! Hey, kid! A little help? Not my problem. Somebody stop that Doesn't dude! Doesn't much to get from where you are to where I am. Aw, you look like a sad little puppy. Yo, buddy. Cheer up. We're gonna check out a killer band. You should come. Remember, happiness is a choice. Look at that dent! This is a brand new car! You stopped at a yellow light! Who stops at a yellow light? People who obey the law, that's who. Right. You respect the law so much you were talking about hey. the phone. That sounded like a gunshot. Ben was my rock in a world where I couldn't count on anything. A world where my parents disappeared. Where a genetically modified spider bite turned me into something... new. But now, Uncle Ben was gone. For his memory. For Aunt May. To make up for not stopping his killer when I should have. I had to become a man. Spider-Man. And I've done some good. Put away a lot of bad guys. But I haven't found the man who killed Uncle Ben. Just one more empty space in life full of it. Killed Uncle Ben is out there somewhere. And I will find him. I'll never stop looking for Uncle Ben's killer. Never. the description of the guy who shot Uncle Ben. I better check it out. Hey, Larry, these guns are heavy. How about a hand? I set this gig up. That makes me the boss, and you the hired help. So shut up and put some effort into it. <sighs> the ringleader looks like the guy who killed Uncle Ben. But I'm not sure. I need to get some pictures of him. Let's get a good look at this guy's ugly face. The image isn't clear enough. Great composition. That's not who I'm after. What the? Glad I trusted my instincts. <laughs> Spider-Man? Hell with it, kill him!
running out of tricks, are we? I can't work under these conditions. The breath reeks. Your lucky night. You're not the guy I'm after. Unless you had a tattoo removed. No, man, no, no, no. I'm, I'm afraid of needles. And heights. So how about let me down, huh? Relax, you're fine. What? Until the webbing dissolves. So, but, you know, the cops will find you by then. Please, what Probably. do you want? Maybe I can help you find who you're looking for. Just, just put me on the ground, yeah? Guess the jails all have the same fashion magazines. <sighs> because there sure are a lot of criminals who look like you. Uh, huh? I'm trying to find this one. Yeah, 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 I, I, I seen that guy. Oh. He sells guns to my boss, Herman Schultz. Lying will not improve my mood. Yeah, I swear. I swear, Mr. Schultz is doing a deal right now. Look, I, I, I don't know if it's with him, but he's buying enough firepower to take on an army, man. Army? Which army? The, the Russians, man. They what? arm up, we arm up. Scary times, man. You, you gotta be ready for anything, you know what I'm talking about? Tell me where to find Schultz, okay? Maybe I'll upgrade your accommodations to a uh, yeah. fire hydrant. Yeah. 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 What do you say? Yeah. Sounds pretty good. Cush. Yeah. Huh? Huh? Uh -huh. Got a deal? to that construction site if I'm gonna find this Herman Schultz guy. Snap! Now that the cops crack down, every crew in the city's running low on guns. This'll give us a hell of an advantage. You mean us? Surrender the guns and maybe you live. Come get them, punks! How about I take the guns? I don't think you guys are qualified to use them responsibly. These are ours now! What's the deal with Spider-Man? Enemy. Did you just expect me to stand there? I think I made my point. You're all better off if no one gets their hands on that ammo. If I focus. Maybe Walk I can sense where the other ammo clicks are. <laughs> Fool me once. <laughs> now I'm on to you. <laughs> okay, so I'm showing off. Two <laughs> down. Let's go for the hat trick. <laughs> Service here is terrible. I demand to speak to your manager. Mr. Schultz, don't worry, he'll find you. Nice dental work. Sorry I have to break it. <laughs> this is 
why they never invite me to gang wars. I ruin all their fun. Ah, <coughs> oh, you must be Schultz. Your goon said you were ugly, but whoa! <laughs> he was being charitable. Think you can take me, huh, freak? <laughs> well, I'm not gonna make it easy for you. Oh, come on! All your friends did! You just buy yourself a ticket to hell! Oh no! I'm so scared! You better pay for that, bud! Not! Can you maybe pretend you know what you're doing? I'm begging you, man. Look, don't kill me like the others. We can make a deal. Others? Yeah, I've got money. Guns. Just tell me what you need, huh? I hear you do business with this guy. Uh, sure. What do you want to know? Huh? The tattoo. What does it mean? Uh, it's a gang thing. There aren't any gangs using that symbol. We, only a few people have it. it. means he's a specialist. A guy who can get you anything you want for the right price. And he'll kill anyone who gets in his way, huh? Yeah. I already knew that. Why can't you and the Russians play nice? Huh? Are you kidding? <laughs> After what they've been doing to our people, then my guys feel like uh, they have to escalate. You know, it's bad for business. But, but, but what are you gonna do, huh? <laughs> Stop it, and you're gonna tell me how. I I'm not sure you can. You ask me, it's gonna get a lot worse before it gets better, huh? Who's the man in the picture, huh? Uh, 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 Carradine. I don't know if that's his real name, huh? He sells guns without those annoying background checks. Where do you meet him? I mean, it's different each time. You put the word out you want to make a deal, he calls. Always on a disposable cell phone. He's a real paranoid fella, you know? Yeah, I... Yeah, he must have a guilty conscience. I, uh, uh, come on, we got a deal? Huh? You want the guy in the picture, huh? Look for a gun dealer in Alphabet City. Okay, he goes by Carradine. I... Stupid! I was so desperate for answers, I let him play me like an amateur! <sighs> like Captain Stacy used to say, use the little fish to catch the big ones. Arms dealers tend to be paranoid. Be careful. No way am I gonna find Carradine unless I hack the closest antenna and intercept his calls. Multiple backup security systems keeping people from hacking the cell tower. Gotta find and decrypt them. Lucky I have an instinct about these things.
Okay, Alphabet City, talk to me. for old Spidey to go clubbing. That's not carrying him. But whoever he is, I can't let him put more guns on the street. The spider! Let's not fight. Ah, never mind. Let's fight. Chase us, or let those people burn! Stan? Hey, how'd you like me to call the Daily Bugle <laughs> and tell them that Jameson is full of it? <laughs> I'm not gonna stop you. So long. I should head over to the comic stand and check in on Stan. Hey, Stan. Oh, welcome back, true believer. Gosh, I haven't seen you in the store since... I can't say it enough. I am so sorry about your Uncle Ben. Oh, he was a good man. He was the best. Thanks. Thanks. I was just remembering how we used to come in together. After the mess I made house-sitting for you, I felt kind of bad. Oh, water under the bridge. Hey, can't I get you anything? Some... Merry Marvel Mayhem to get the old pulse pounding. Nah, I was just passing by, but I'll come back. Well, enough said. Anytime you need inspiration, I'll be right here. Spending so much time as Spider-Man, I feel naked without the mask on. Man, am I gonna need so much therapy. So he says to him, one meat lovers. Okay, in what world does meat lovers mean mushrooms? 
yeah way. And I'm like, nah-uh. And she's all like, yeah it's so true. This is Carradine. What do you need? Firepower, man. It's getting crazy out there, you know what I'm saying? We need some serious boomstick, and they say you're the guy that can make that happen. Alley behind Nuno's bar, two hours. Turbo boost! You gonna count that? I thought we had trust. Hey, you're funny. Hey, what's that? Stop! <laughs> Come on! Move over! Hostage. Not good. Let's go, man. No way am I letting you kill anyone else. Find Carradine soon, I'll lose him. I promise, Uncle Ben. I promise he won't get away this time. He can't have gotten far. I need to report a dead body. Suitable for framing. If I get spotted, this is gonna get ugly. Gotta move faster. I get it, Doc. I know how this is supposed to go. I tell you my parents beat me or dropped me on my head. I had a horrible childhood. Boo-hoo! And sure, it had its moments. My dad beat me unconscious, my mom drank. But a lot of people go through that and don't end up like I did. Here's what really happened. When I was still just a kid, I saw the truth. Life is meaningless. 
Death is the only thing that matters. Aunt May's gonna hear about this sooner or later. And I don't want her to be alone when she does. Life is so weird. I gotta find another way. Better head home before Aunt May sends the police out looking for me. The guy who killed Uncle Ben is gone. You'd think that would bring me some peace. But I don't feel peaceful. Not even close. murderer and arms dealer. Carradine has been identified as the perpetrator in last year's shooting of Queens resident Benjamin Parker. Some New Yorkers we spoke to applaud the fact that violent criminals are being taken off the streets. Hey, somebody wants to clean up the trash. I say more power to them. But police caution that the perpetrator is a threat to everyone. This individual is a dangerous psychopath. He commits acts of extreme carnage and brutality. Leaving the initials CK written in blood as a signature. The crime scenes are so gruesome, they shock even veteran officers. Due to the letters and the horrific nature of the crimes, authorities are calling this man the Carnage Killer. Anyone with information should call the police immediately. This is Whitney Chang for the Daily Bugle News Network. Horrible. But at least it's finally over. The man who took Ben from us won't ever hurt anyone again. Maybe now we can move on. Peter? W what's the matter? So, you feel better? My husband's still gone. I think that'll hurt forever. You said you thought maybe we could move on. Yes, uh, now that there isn't that question hanging over us. Where is he? Why don't they catch him? Now we can look ahead. But it's not like being... happy. We'll be happy again, Peter. I promise you. I wish for bad things to happen to this Carradine guy. A lot. That's perfectly natural. He killed your uncle. Yeah, but... Peter, Parker, it's bad enough you feel guilty about Ben. I I won't let you beat yourself up over this. Why would it be your fault? Did you kill that man? No. He was a criminal. He associated with awful people. It's not as if you had any control over that. What, what could you have done? <sighs> Aunt May, the truth is, I'm glad he's dead. I know that's wrong. You're relieved a bad man can't hurt anyone else. That's different. You're glad a murderer was brought to justice. There's nothing wrong with that. I know. It's just... I... Part of you wishes you're the one who did the bringing to justice? Yeah. <laughs> That's not what Ben would have wanted. He wanted you to work hard, graduate, go to college, all the things you did. 
Wherever he is, he's very proud of you, and so am I. You heard Whitney Chang. Some people are grateful to the Carnage Killer. I kind of know how they feel. That's not the same as condoning it. You're not glad this Carnage person is out there murdering, are you? You want him taken off the streets, don't you? Yes. Yeah, I do. And he will be. Uh, Aunt May, can you turn that up? We have breaking news of a hostage situation at Oscorp. Armed men are holding several employees at gunpoint. Oh, no. Security camera footage has identified the ringleader as career criminal Herman Schultz. Schultz? What? Uh, go I should make sure. Oh, that's a good idea. I always thought you two never should have split up. Um, don't wait up for me. It's my fault Schultz got away. If he hurts anyone... No, not this time. Holy... I've got to get up there. Oh, man. People are gonna need help. will do it. He's a little guy he can fit. Always Vlad gets the dirty jobs. Nighty night. are gonna take me. What's your name? Max. Max Dillon. Okay, Max. Easy choice. Tell us where to find the weapons, or you uh, die. I'm an electrical engineer. I don't have access to those areas. Then it's a bad day to be you, eh, Max? <laughs> you know, I hear jail's a lot nicer now. The toilets have seats and everything. <laughs> no more treats. Now you must fight. <laughs> Sometimes they keep talking about a weapon. I bet my last web Schultz is heading for the Special Projects Division. You're Mr. Spider-Man! Just Spider-Man. Mr. Spider-Man was my father. What's your name? Uh, Max. Max Dillon. 
I'm in R&D. Well, Max, I need you to help me out. Be my eyes and ears. Can you do that? Really? I mean, yes! I won't let you down. Good. Get the hostages out through stairwell C. It's all clear. I really appreciate the help, partner. Partner? Lights go out? This building's powered by an experimental fission reactor. If it explodes, we all die. Great. Where is it? With the blast door shut, there's only one way to reach it. These guys are containers of extra coolant to the core. You can stick to things, right? Misconnections, Ad. You think I'd skip town? 
give New York to freaks like you? No way! I just needed an equalizer. And now? <laughs> I've got it! Say hello to the Seismic Harness Construction Resource. Or, as I like to call it. Work under these conditions. Your breath reeks. You're using it as a weapon? Come on, Herman. Think outside the box. You can make a fortune selling milkshakes. Just wait till I get used to these things. You're a dead man. Now I'm getting queasy. If you make me throw up in my mask, I'm sending you the dry cleaning bill. Jail? I'm not letting nut jobs like you take over my city. Nut job? What? Yeah, I'm not the one calling my weapon the shocker without a trace of iron. Sensible smack upside the head for dinner. I, you can't lock me up, man. I, the, the Russians can get to me inside. You might be able to make a deal with D.A. Harper for protective custody uh, if you help stop this gang war. Innocent people are getting caught up in it. I can't. It's bigger than me now. All the gangs in the city are at war. Everyone's scared of everyone else. The Russians got here at almost the same time you did. I know. One of my guys must have dropped a dime. Now that your future looks, let's go with limited. What'll they do? Keep arming up. Take out what's left of my men and everybody else in town. <laughs> they're ruthless. I promise you. By the time they're done, you'll wish you had Herman Schultz back. <sighs> so, you broke in here for a power-up? Absolutely. Guns won't do it anymore. Everybody wants an ace that the others don't have. The kind of fighter power that you can fight an army with. And I bet they don't care who gets caught in the crossfire. That's why they call them bad guys. What are all you tough guys so afraid of? The carnage killer. He's murdering my people, huh? The, 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 the Russians? Hammerhead's crew? Mr. Negative's men? Uh, everyone thinks the other guys are paying him. I'm starting to worry he's some kind of freak. Like that giant lizard a while back, or that dude with all the, the, the robots. So, <laughs> as long as he's out there killing, the gang war goes on? And it gets worse! Unless you want to go for a butt-whipping hat trick, you'll tell the cops everything you know about the gang war. Okay, but it won't do any good. Look, the city's full of trigger-happy wise guys. Scared the carnage killer's gonna get them. That's one fire that's just gonna keep on spreading, huh? Huh. You know, as much as I made fun of these things, they're pretty clever. If I could get this kind of kinetic energy into my webbing... Now who's the thief, huh? <laughs>
You know Oscorp, but you might not know me. I'm Harry Osborne. When my father died, he didn't just leave me a business. He left me a New York institution. But too often lately, both Oscorp and this city have been preyed on by criminals. Now today, I'm announcing a joint venture with a man who, like me, recently returned to the city where he was born and wants to help. Wilson Fisk. New York made me the man I am. Now, I want to give something back. It was my privilege to rebuild this great city after recent crises, but that was just the start. Allow me to introduce you to the Enhanced Prime Task Force. Now the police are doing a fine job with limited resources, but when they face threats outside their normal scope, they need more, and we have a Rather than increase the burden on taxpayers, Mr. Fisk and I are financing this hand-picked task force ourselves. Vigilantes like Spider-Man only make the problem worse. This is our city, and we're taking it back together. And my answer is still no. Well, that's fine. I'll just wait until you die of the disease that killed your father. Attention all task force personnel. You are authorized to be in phase one of the suppression initiative. Repeat. Now's a good time to take down some bad guys, while the task force is putting heat on them. a drop in car thefts now that criminals know even a high-powered engine can't save them from Spider-Man.
You know, I'd love to know how the task force is gonna stop the crime wave when all they ever do is come after me. Available units, please respond to a disturbing the peace situation. Suspects may Who's be armed. Who's here to hit the liquor store? To get predictable. <laughs> no fancy tricks, eh, voila! I almost feel like a bully. Spider-Man showed once again that no crime is too small to escape his notice. Car 42, we have reports of fighting, possibly gang-related, in Central Park, Southwest Corner. Can you check it out? Central Park, Southwest Corner? I bet I can get there quicker than the cops. Huh, just a few blocks as the spider swings. I promise. Now to find the one that got away. Hey, wrapping up bad guys is my thing. I can help you? Okay, Mr. Craven the Hunter. You got my attention. We have shots fired at the bus station. Proceed with caution. Suspects heavily armed. <gasps> All units, officers are under fire at the bus station. 
Need assistance immediately. experienced enough to beat your friends I am Russian but I am no friend to those pigs my name is Sergei Kravenov men call me Craven the hunter so you left me that note huh. judging from the web you're one of those crazy reality show guys who runs around naked in the woods eating bugs how can you help me I can make you a true hunter not just a boy pretending to be a man. Should you wish to accept, you may find me here. Until we meet again. Parker, why didn't you get me pictures from the Fisk Osborne press conference? Oh, sorry, Mr. Jameson, but I've got school. You know, life outside the job. In my day, your job was your life. A press pass is wasted on you! Actually, I just got an idea for using my press pass. I've got to admit, it would be nice not to feel like I'm fighting this battle on my own. But is Craven someone I can trust? Craven obviously doesn't know who I really am, or he would have come to my house. I don't know. I've always worked best alone. But then again, I've never tried it any other way. If Craven can teach me his hunting techniques, I won't have to rely on police broadcasts to find bad guys. It's not like I'd tell Craven my... <sighs> okay, don't be nervous. You need information on Craven, and you've got a press pass to get it with. <laughs> Easy peasy. Never mind that if he finds out you're a photographer and not a reporter, he'll have you stuffed and mounted. Mr. Kravenoff? It's me, Peter Parker, from the Daily Bugle. We, we spoke on the phone. The, the door was open. Uh, Mr. Kravenoff? <laughs> oh, I apologize for startling you. I am Craven. Please forgive my theatrics. 
I merely wish to demonstrate my skills. The videos online do that pretty well. I saw you take down that Siberian tiger with your bare hands, without hurting it. Tigers are endangered. I simply relocated the beast for its own safety, as well as that of the local villagers. True hunters wish to conserve the natural world. It is where we find peace. You're a long way from the natural world. I craved a new challenge. I came here to hunt the monsters Oscorp created. The cross species. The deadliest combination of animal and human. I ended their threat. But I grew fond of your city. And your city grew fond of me. <laughs> and I decided to stay. Except now you're hunting normal people. No! Only criminals. Only those who prey on their fellow man have anything to fear from me. This new task force is sending a pretty strong message. No vigilantes. Ah, I do not trust them. They are paid for by Fisk. I am sure you've heard the rumors of his illegal activities. Sure, everyone has. But no one can prove it. And the police seem okay with him. Because he has paid those who are corrupt. The rest are desperate to avoid looking incompetent. Well, the public is desperate for an end to the crime wave. I have only one agenda. To get results. Based on my experience, uh, research, the police aren't big fans of vigilantes. The police had their chance to stop the crime wave. They failed miserably. I, uh, don't think they like being reminded of that. I do not wish to insult them. But it would be a far greater crime to have the power to help, but refuse to act. Would you not agree? Yeah. As a matter of fact, I would. Is man really the most dangerous game? In their own way, yes. But men are merely highly evolved animals. The current crime wave provides fascinating opportunities to study them. The patterns of the various factions. And what are you finding out? That criminals are not unlike beasts. They have hunting grounds, specific behaviors. Many travel in packs, but there are differences. Such as? Animals prey on others for survival. Only human beings are willfully cruel. Hmm. So you're saying you feel a responsibility to use your power to help? Yes. To have such power and not use it is to be unworthy of it. Uh, well, thanks. I, I think our readers will find this very interesting. Good, good. I must take this call. But please, look around. Take pictures of anything you wish. Yes? No, I said tranquilizer darts. No, I have no interest in automatic weapons. They require no skill.
When do you consider it okay to kill? When there is no other choice. I do not take life lightly. But when it is necessary, I do not hesitate. If my failure to act cost the life of an innocent person, I could not live with myself. I know what you mean. They all had superhuman powers. How'd you beat them? I have trained myself to the peak of human ability, and learned many natural means of enhancement. Not drugs, like the scum who pollute the streets, but the secrets of native cultures. Herbs, potions, mysteries forgotten by so-called civilized man. Hunting criminals... Some people might wonder if you're the Carnage Killer. <sighs> he is no hunter, but a brute. A savage. His very existence is offensive to men like myself. So even though he's hunting criminals, you'd like to take him down? Of course. He dishonors what I do. Without honor, Peter, the hunt means nothing. Last question. Is there anything you haven't accomplished yet? Ah, uh, yes. I would like to leave a legacy when I am gone. Pass my training to a protege. My only family is a brother who... Well, he chose a different path. I never had a son, but... Perhaps... Uh, forgive me. I am becoming melancholy as I get older. So... Do you have what you need, Mr. Parker? Yeah, I think I do.